Hello guys, Genos here and welcome to Counterside and today in this video I'm here to present you guys with a detailed reroll guide where I'm going to be teaching you guys on how to reroll in this game so that you can start a fresh new account in this game with your favorite characters in it. And you can do this even through your Android cell phone devices. Yes, you heard me right. Alright, so let's get this started. First of all, to talk about, this game has a problem. Even after clearing the catchy of this data, you just cannot get rid of the guest account. That means you gotta reinstall this game that is worth 4.63 gigabyte of data. And that is such a great inconvenience to create a new account in this game, okay? So I've got a really quick fix for that one. So let's get this started. First of all, please quit the game. Go into the App Store and please try to download this application known as the multiple accounts, dual accounts and parallel space. So what it does that like it allows you to create a virtual copy of the counter side and you will be able to start counter side as a fresh new copy so that you can create a new guest account right over there without even uninstalling and reinstalling the counter side itself. So it really does save you a lot of time and data. So well, let's open it up. And it's uh, it's gonna ask you for a lot of permissions out there. Please do allow all of them. And it's gonna even ask for a certain type of assistant type of applications to be installed in your device. Please do allow that one as well, or else it will not function properly. And now what we gotta do is we gotta add. Click on the bottom right corner, the plus sign, and then search for the counter side in the list. Okay, and it's gonna be right over here. Can you see that? Yes, the counter side is right over there in the C section. Right, click on it, and now it's adding or making a new fresh virtual copy of counter side, and now it's starting it already. So now this is gonna be a fresh new start of the counter side where we can make a new account through the guest account. So let's get this started. Okay, so right here it's asking us to wait. Okay, we are gonna wait for it. All right, it's loading up all the stuff out there. All right, and now we gotta create a new account through guest account, which is on the bottom uh, corner. Okay, please don't try to create a new account with Google, Facebook, or Twitter, cause the bind is gonna be permanent in this game. All right, you gotta create a new account with the guest account and when you are pretty satisfied with whatever you have got so far, you can bind it to your account later. No problem with that one. I'm gonna teach you guys how to bind your account to these uh, social media platforms, okay? So don't worry about that one. Let's click on the guest, confirm, and now we will be able to enjoy a brand new game, okay? So let's get it started. Tap on the screen. All right, so let's get it started. See, there we go, there we go. Let's give this shit. Okay, so there might be so many players out there and so many community that might actually say that this is a very dangerous process. This might actually, you know, like corrupt your device or let's say it might actually cause some harm to your device. Well, for me, it has been working really great so far. Okay, so I'm not really into it. Though people might actually say that like this game, uh, this kind of process might not be that healthy for your device, okay? Because like it really does interrupt with your codes and process or whatever that is. But so far, I've got no problem and no issues with it. Anyways, do it at your own risk. That's what I'm trying to say. So, so far for me, I've encountered no issues. No problem with my device. Everything is going on really fine, okay? Just giving you a warning, warning, you know, like a, a fine warning. <laughs> Even though I have not really encountered any kind of issue at all with this process. So well, let's go on with it. So yeah, there we go. So now, we are actually gonna go with this uh, tutorial process. And it's not really that long. I mean like, reroll process in this game is pretty fast, okay? So well, let's go on, let's do it. Okay. Yes, that's the villain. We gotta do with that villain. Yeah, there we go. And through my process, guys, you can do up to 50 summons. Yes, you heard me right. Or let's say five multi summons if you are going to collect all together. 50 summons. That's a really good number of summons that you can do for a reroll, right? And there is a 3.5% gacha rate for SSR units to drop in this game. So it's a really win win situation out here. Okay, let's hire the units out there. Let's do as the, you know, like the game commands. Okay, I'm gonna use the ultimate skill. Yes, spatula slash. Boom, there we go. Cross the opponent down. All right. Wham! Totally easy, right? So far, so good. Skip. And by the way, guys, I would really appreciate it if you can subscribe to my channel. Please, do subscribe to my channel. And hit that like button. That would be a really great help as well. Anyways, let's keep moving on. 
I'm really planning to actually cover up on this game so you can actually expect to have a lot of videos on counter side from now onwards from me Jenna's Gacha. So let's hire that unit over there. Let's do it. Boom, there we go. Let's hire another unit out there in the battlefield. We're doing great so far. No problem. All right. Okay, flying COS. Okay, let's try to hire the um, all attacker so that she can actually take care of the flying units. Boom, there we go. We have got more assault units. Okay. Now we are going to nuke the opponent out there. No problem. I'll take care of them. Wow, okay. No problem, man. All right. Looks really easy so far. No problem, right? Yay. Yeah, let's do it. Let's use the ultimate skill, can we? Oh, no. All right. So we are done with this, okay? Let's move on to the next phase. All right, all right, all right. Let's get this shit out here. Okay, that's landing point. Let's click on it. Okay, close it. Add. Okay, empty. Add the stuff out here. Auto form. Cross. Okay, that's great. That's that's good enough. Let's try to set her as the leader. And now let's add. Let's go into the operation out here. Yes. Click on this airship. Then click on the opponent out there. And we are going to engage in the fight. So that's pretty much a basic tutorial out here, ladies and gentlemen. Not much of a big issue to actually get worried about. Alright, so we are going to hire our unit into the battlefield. They are going to require a certain amount of cost before they get hired into the battlefield, okay? So you got to make sure that the cost is available on your side. And always look out for the icon above the head of the hero units out there. Because if there is an icon popping out, click on it in order to unleash the ultimate skill. Let's try to hire another unit in the battlefield. Let's try to use the artillery support. Yes, there we go. Ultimate skill. Oh, shit. My hero just died. Oh, my God. Even if your hero is dead, you can redeploy that unit into the battlefield. It just takes some, like, cooldown effect out there. But you will be able to rehire them or redeploy them into the battlefield, okay? It's too easy. Anyways, let's keep moving on. Let's keep this shit out here. Okay, we are done with that. Okay, boom. There we go. Congratulations, we got a victory out here. Nice. Now we are level 2. I can't level 2. Come on, yes. Recruitment unlocked. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we will be able to do something real good out here in this game, which is so amazing. A guaranteed SSR summon. Lobby. Let's go to the lobby. Let's go into the recruit. And now, guys, as a beginner, you will be provided 30 twice of multi summon. That's going to get into you guys one SSR character, three SR characters, three rare characters, and three normal characters. One SSR character is going to be guaranteed no matter what. So you can actually possibly get any SSR unit, hero unit of your choice because there are not much SSR unit in this game for now, okay? So chill out. Let's click on the uh, recruitment over here. Let's do it. So now you might be asking, hey, Genos. What are we supposed to get out of this reroll process? I mean, like, at this particular SSR selection summon. And I would say that would be Kyle. Okay, try to get Kyle in this. Please, try to get him, because he's a very amazing unit that would really help you to uh, clear the contents real fast in this game, okay? Kyle is a very amazing character. See Shaolin. Okay, this is the best, ca second best character out here in this game. If you are really looking forward for a waifu unit who is very, very strong, then Shaolin can actually provide you a really great sustenance. But in here, we are really trying to get the Kyle. Kyle Wong. Yes, the name is Kyle Wong. Let's try to do it. She is she for you. Okay, no problem. That's going to be the uh, another unit. Let's do it. That's going to be Nana. That's going to be Nahara. Okay, that's going to be Kyle, I guess. Yes, the Kyle Wong. It's not really hard to get Kyle Wong from here. There's 30 twice. And in every try, you will be guaranteed the SSR character. There's a very low chance that you are not going to land or get Kyle Wong. Okay, so don't worry at all, guys. He's the guy with that assault rifle on his hand. Okay, so you are supposed to get this thing out here. If you're asking me, Janus, can't we get like two SSR characters in this selective summon? No, <laughs> you cannot. Everything is just totally already uh, defined. One SSR character, three SR character, and uh, three normal character, and three rare character. So that's going to be it. Confirm the recruitment, and that's going to be it, guys. Let's be done with this. Kyle Wong is in our party, effectively. 
And now, ladies and gentlemen, there is now another event going on right now. Every day you can do one multi summon for now. So you can check it out right over here on the right hand side corner. Free recruit 10 times, right? So let's click on it and we will be able to do another multi summon right over here. So 20 summons right away, right? Keep the count, keep the count. Okay, let's click on it. Boom! SSR character! Yes! Oh yes! Oh yes, yeah, Shaolin! Oh my god, the wife is here! The wife is here! Wow! That's good! I got two SSR units! I got two SSR units! Elizabeth as well! I might actually keep this account! This is good! Woo! Already three SSR characters, man! Already three SSR characters. And now what you gotta do? Click on the mailbox on the top right corner. Click on the mailbox. You can now see that. You can get that 10x recruitment tickets right over here, the employment contract. And you will be able to get this 600 quads as well. All right? So get all of this. All of this. All right? And you are actually gonna get a free Sylvia Lena Cooper. Okay, that's, that's good. Now, what we are gonna do, go back. And let's try to do summon in this banner, okay? Now, after all words, you are supposed to do summons on this banner with the blue tickets that you have or the quads you have. Why? Because SSR Young Harim is one of the best waifu unit character out there. She's the best supporter out there and she can help you a lot through your entire gaming content. Whether it be the early game content or the late game content. So you are supposed to multi summon right over here. No questions asked, okay? And this might be it. Come on, give me another SSR Young Harim. Come on. Oh shit, another Kyle Wong. Okay, okay, I will take him. I'll take him. I'll take him. That's great, man. So far, so good. Really happy. Really, really happy, man. I'm really happy with all the summons that I'm getting. And see, now, I already did 30, 30 summons, right? Three multi summons out there. 30 summons. Now, this is going to allow me to do another 8 summons out here. That's going to be a total of 38 summons, right? So, let's do it. There's a VIP customer. That means it's another SSR unit. Wow, this is the best. This is the best. Oh shit, I thought this is the SSR character. Holy crap, my bad, my bad. Because it said a VIP customer. Oh shit, I thought it was SSR character. My bad, my bad. No problem with that one. Anyways, I'm actually gonna go. Anyways, right over here guys, you can see that like there is an insured recruitment system. With the insured recruitment system, you can actually get guaranteed Yes, you heard me right. Guaranteed unit out there after a certain number of summons out here. And the PD summon will happen at 150 summon. Okay, so that is really good guys. Having the probability of 3.5% chance for SSR characters to drop with the 150 uh, summons of PD summon. I think it's really great value. Really, really great value guys. Okay, so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to go back. And now this game is actually going to ask me for my account name. And I'm going to actually put uh, Genos. All right, can I do that? Yes, there we go. Genos is my name, and it's gonna be added right over here. Boom, there we go. Let's click on the missions, and this is gonna be the place we will be able to get a lot more tickets out here. Just watch me, okay? We'll be able to get, I think, 12 more tickets out here. So, let's do it. Okay, let's click on complete all. Level up, yes, our account is getting leveled up out here. Okay, weekly missions out here, just follow the process get because there's a little bit of tutorial going on around let's get back and it's asking me to go out here but we will not be going inside it okay we are just gonna quit it right away because we really are not interested in completing the story mode for now so this is gonna be the login guest that you are gonna be provided okay tomorrow you are also gonna get that multiple summon right away uh, 10 times summon now see right over here new users missions you'll be able to get this uh, recruitment tickets right over here the employment contract ticket click on it and you will get that free contract ticket right at the bat okay so that's that that's one thing uh, that's one way how to do it okay and next is that you got to go into this mission out here click on this mission and click on the achievement and there we go can you see that employment contract ticket right over there click on that complete okay so we have already got four more tickets out here six eight that's great isn't it we have already got the bonus eight tickets out there and well guess what guys now we can actually go into the uh, manage click on the collection out here and here you will be able to get extra quads that will allow you to do more summons out here okay so let's see out here yes there we go some 30 30 quads out here okay so we are actually gonna go into the lobby and now this time we will actually do more summons out here let's do it recruit we're gonna do it 
Click on the Yang Harim banner out here and we will be summoning her right over here. Yes, there we go, all right? Come on, please. Ah, oh, shit. SR unit, not an SSR unit, okay? <gasps> I think I just didn't get any SSR unit. I got Hayami Sanai. Wow. Today's my luck. Today is my day. My god, I just cannot believe this. Is this really happening to me? Wow. Wow. We are never gonna even like neglect a single summon out here, okay? Let's do everything that we can possibly. Oh, that's just a rare unit. Just a rare unit, okay? Uh, that's gonna be it. How about the recruit on demand? Let's do it. Come on, any kind of summon is worth it, worth to summon, okay? Come on. Oh, SR unit right away. Yes, that's gonna be a two star unit. That's gonna be Lee Jean. <gasps> waifu! 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 Okay, so there we go. I'm pretty happy with that one. Alright. So, guys. Uh, that's it and done, guys. Alright? So now, uh, what, I'm, what I can do right now over here is... Let's go back to the lobby. And now, you will be able to see that mission is already available as well. See? Two more tickets out there. Yes. Complete all. And you will be able to get extra tickets just like that. Too easy, wasn't it? Right? So with that said and done, guys, now we can actually go back into the recruit and let's do more summons out here, right over here. Even if it's just two summon tickets, we are not going to neglect that. We are not going to neglect that, ladies and gentlemen. We are not going to neglect that. Ah, oh, shit, just SR units, okay. Oh, I mean, like, normal units, okay. So, well, we are gonna go back to the lobby and you can actually see it out here in achievements. See? Two more tickets out here. Two more tickets. The more you summon, the more tickets are you are going to get unlocked, okay? So this is a really amazing feature out here in this game. I'm gonna go right over here. Let's do another multi-summon out here. Come on, come on, girl. You gotta be mine. You gotta be mine. Oh! 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 Yes! Yes! That's what the re-rolling process really means. This is the value of the re-roll process in this game. Young Harim is mine. <sighs> oh my god wow wow this is luck filling the salt filling the gacha salt <laughs> no i i think that's gonna be it okay so i think we did a, a total of 50 summons out here in this game 50 total summons if i'm not wrong if i'm wrong please do let me in the comment section below all right well, that's the thing out there. If you want to check out your units, go into the management out here and you will be able to see all the characters that you have just managed to get right over here. Okay, I will be actually clicking on the rarity and you can see one, a two, a three, a four, a five, a six, six SSR characters in just one reroll. This is a free to play game, guys. 3.5% gacha rate. If someone is out there telling that 3.5 gacha rate is so bad, Screw you, okay? It's really good, it's really healthy. 3.5% drop rate, it's really, really awesome, guys. And I got Shaolin, I got Kai Wong, I got Yang Harim, I got Hayami Sanai, I got Elizabeth, I got... Really good stuff, guys, really good stuff, okay? So, well, now, 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 now. This account is really good, right? Rigidly, it's really good. Now, I want to bind this account, so how do I do that? Now, click on the top right corner on the menu, click on the gear icon on the settings menu, click on the bandits account right over here, and then click on the customer center. Yes, click on the customer center. And now, this is actually gonna allow you to bind your account. Let it load up. Yes, click on the bind account. And now it's gonna ask you like, which method are you really going to try to use, okay? What I'm actually gonna do is, I'm gonna click on the Facebook account for now. I'm gonna bind it to my Facebook account. Okay, come on. Oh shit, my, ac my Facebook account is not ready yet. Okay, no problem, no problem. Aish. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna go back. And I'm actually gonna just uh, use customer center. Let me bind my account through the Twitter account. Is there a way? Come on, come on, come on, come on. I think I have already logged in into my Twitter account. Ah, oh, come on. I don't want to show you my, you know, like my username and password. It's too sad, okay. Let me actually go through the Google account. Okay, I've got no choice. I got no choice, okay. I got really no choice. In here as well, it's checking for info. Okay, so if you are going to <laughs> use this method, you just cannot actually you know, like get access to your information right away, okay? 
So well, that's the problem out here. Anyways, that's how you are going to bind your account right over here. I just don't want to show you my username and account and so many other things out here for now. Okay, anyways, that's how you are supposed to bind your account. And now, what if you are not satisfied with whatever you have rerolled so far? What are you supposed to do then? Well, just quit the account yet again. And, well, uh, what you got to do is that you got to go into the apps, you know, like apps, the settings and apps. And in this place, what you got to do is you got to find the multiple accounts, this, this application out here. Okay, multiple accounts, this one, click on this, 846 megabyte, okay? And then what you gotta do is go into the stories and clear the data and the clear the cache. All right, cause the one that, I mean like this multiple accounts, this application that what we are using is on trial version. I mean like, it's not premium version, it's not a VIP version, meaning like you can only have one instance at a time, okay? So in order to refresh this uh, application, you gotta clear the data and clear the cache. And after that, once, that, after that onwards, only you will be able to create a new instance for the, um, this, this, this counter side yet again, and you will be able to create a new fresh account with the guest account, just the way that I showed you guys a while ago, all right? I go back into the multiple accounts right away, and then, uh, okay, never mind. Turn off, okay, and then just click on the uh, settings out here, and then after that one, just click on the counter side, just like this, right over here. Click on it, and it's gonna create a new uh, application just like that, okay, and then it's gonna start it. Yes, that's how it's happening. So it's too easy, guys, too easy. Not a big problem out here, too easy, guys. So yeah, that's how it is. And every time you create a new instance, it's gonna allow you to create a new guest account. And once you are like satisfied with whatever you have got so far you can just keep your account and have fun with it and now I gotta go back to the game and start binding my account to my real Google accounts okay so well till then guys see you guys in the next video I hope you have a lot of fun with this uh, video and I think you enjoyed uh, I mean like I think you learned a lot from this video as well if you guys have any troubles questions queries let me know in the comment section below and have a really good discussion about that one and that's it and done see you guys in the next video